Hi, and welcome back to Two Minutes with the VA. Our next question is from Lisa. Uh, Lisa, Seth, Lisa, Lisa, I'm not sorry. Uh, she, she said that I had mentioned something about Boomerang for Gmail in one of my previous videos, and she wanted me to tell her a little bit about it. Okay, so Boomerang is like my brain, right? Okay, um, I use it in Gmail. I use Gmail for all of my uh, email correspondence. All of my emails dump into my one huge Gmail account, um, and then from there, uh, you know, it gets sorted out. I deal with the emails as they come in, and, and you know, all that good stuff. But Boomerang is awesome. So it's a way that you can do several different things. It has several different things you can do. Um, you, I use it all the time, like every day, several times a day. I think I pay like 15 bucks a month for it. it it's basically free at that point for, for what I get out of it. Okay, so you can, let's say that you're working on Saturday and you don't want your client to know that you're working on Saturday. You can write the email to them and have it go out to them Monday morning. Um, so you can schedule messages. You can also set it, so let's say that an email comes in from a client and you don't want to deal with it right then, you want to deal with it tomorrow, right? So usually we just leave it sitting in your inbox and it gets, you know, piled up and, you know, it's just too much. So you can click the little boomerang button and tell it to send it back to you tomorrow at like 11 a.m. or whenever you want it or, you know, in 2015 or whenever you, you know, whenever you need to see it. Um, I use this a lot whenever clients, for instance, hire new employees and I need to set them up on medical or something and you've got that 90 day wait period. Uh, so I'll send it to Boomerang back to me on the, you know, 90 days so I'll know to go ahead and do that. So that, that's one of the ways that I use that feature. The other thing that's really cool is, so, okay, how many times, this happens to me all the time. So you send an email to a client and you're waiting for a response from them, right? A uh, typical thing for me is I need them to approve an invoice or something to pay. And you don't hear from back from them, you don't hear back from them, and it slips your mind, and a month goes by, and then the vendor is calling, and they're yelling and screaming. Okay. So what you can do is you can send that email to the client and say, hey, can I pay, you know, uh, ABC company? And you can set it so that you put a little checkbox, and if they don't hear back from you within a day or two or seven days or by a certain time or whatever, um, then it will boomerang it back into your inbox. So that's the important thing. Whenever I say boomerang, I mean it's going to come right back into your inbox, uh, which is really neat because it shows up right whenever you need it. Uh, if you're working on a project and you're gathering all these little pieces and you know you want to work at it on Friday, you can boomerang all that back to you at Friday at 9 a.m. or whatever's convenient for you. Um, so that, that's really cool. It's a way to, you know, delay things, get it out of your inbox, keep your inbox clean. I'm really big on inbox um, heaven, and I'll put a link to all that down here. Um, so, yeah, Boomerang, awesome, awesome, awesome. Get it. it it's well worth it. All right.